with. Don't know how to knock. Don't know how to sit. Don't know how to fly. Don't know how to miss. Just know I'm on top. And you on the bench. Don't know how to vote. You know what this is. I'm going for gold. Throwing up bricks. And I'm about to pop. And you only wish. I'm calling my shot. And here it goes. Don't know how to stop. Jayon Brown, what's it like to be one of the old guys now? Man, it, it <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'm used to it, I guess. Year four, still young, but but old on the team. This is me in my fourth year, and I'm embracing it. <laughs> I got you with that one. Have you had an old guy moment yet with any of the rookies where you thought, oh, gosh? I wouldn't say an old guy moment, but just knowing what to expect and to see guys dealing with certain stuff at, uh, at practice and through this football process, just knowing that that you have that, that knowledge of being of being going through that experience first, second year, even third year, that I can uh, give my knowledge to, to help a younger guy out. Okay, so now I've teased you a little bit about that, but the serious part is Wesley Woodyard was such a big part of your room and a big part of your football life, and I know you think the world of him to this day. Jarrell Casey was a leader, Logan Ryan was a leader. Now that you are one of the more veteran players on the defense, it's changed for you. Have you sensed that you needed to take more of a leadership role because of the absence of those players? A hundred percent. We got we got uh, you know good good leaders and captains on our team with uh, Daquan and Kevin Bayard. But as a group of veteran dudes like like myself, like Kenny Vaccaro, like Rashawn Evans as well, we just got to come together and and just hold ourselves to a high standard and be vocal. But yeah, for myself personally, me calling being a play caller, I got to be a vocal person. No matter how tough it is on the field out there, whatever situation we're in, to just help everybody like stay stay calm, collected, and just do our job and go out there and, and, and play ball. We're right at that sort of getting to that midway part of the season. I want to ask you, do you have a favorite moment of the season so far? Against uh, Houston, uh, just seeing our offense dominate and come up in a, in a clutch victory drive to bring us home in uh, overtime, that, that was definitely a, a real fun moment and uh, a really good team win. And I'm loving it each by week and just letting it all soak in. As you head down the stretch of the season, what does Jayon Brown need to do to make it a really successful season for you individually? I just just keep doing my job and, uh, and doing my part in this defense and, and being a play caller, being a playmaker and getting dudes lined up and keep being a, a, a role leader on this team to just help lead us to victory. Sounds like you're describing an old dude. Oh, man. <laughs> year four, man. Year four. It came up fast. Came up fast. Well, keep doing what you're doing. We're proud of you, and we appreciate you, Jayon. Thank you so much.